we're gonna take turn all the members into Ingram. Not sure how I'd feel about that, to be honest, but like, cause, cause it kind of sounds cool. I was merely teasing. <laughs> <laughs> so, if start from here is where I'm things. Sorry, did I the... Yeah, go ahead, Ron. Did that go through? I think I cut out. I didn't quite catch what you if you did say anything. Uh, if Alpha existed at this point, would you have squeezed her in? Mm, like I said, with Lo trying to work Sora into the mix, probably not. Uh. Keyblade, the keyblading would have been a hell of effort. So yeah, this is the point of the ROM hack where, like I said, this is where I hit my stride, I suppose, and things get a little bit more different than uh, vanilla FE4 or, or F7. Because now I just start inserting stuff, stuff like prepare to see a lot more OCs and just mind gabbling of the of my magamations of the plot, just trying to mix in and coalesce with FE sevens, for better or worse, mostly worse. But I'd like to say I like, tried an attempt to make it work in game. Oh, hi, Len. Hi, We're gonna see you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh god, I can take that so many ways, but I'm going to take it into the Kellic way now, because, oh man, that was that was barely even a blip at the time, Tactics Universe. When he was when He's gonna kill chaos. Like, gonna when this was finished, Kellic was still just a fucking... Chaos. Ephraim so recolor. Jack. Yeah, he was still Ephraim he's around. Still a lot longer hair than Jack, but yeah, uh, he looks like Final Fantasy Origins Jack. I will kill Chaos. I was gonna say Jack's bald. longer hair, but yeah. nondescript white man. Alistair and Bradley. Is this Bradley? Woo. That was Bradley, and that's Alistair. Okay. Good news, everyone. Good news, everyone. Jack's SSD came in. Oh shit! Nice. Ooh. Nice. Very cool. I'm not gonna lie, all these years later, I still like Bradley. Bradley's probably my favorite of the four, though. Well, it makes one of us. He was, <laughs> he was my least inspired of the of the four. It, it kind of seemed that way looking at it, considering, like, Alistair looks hella nice, and then Jack and Madeline probably have just the most characterization because they're married, but then I'm like... But Bradley's the dude here to vibe. Bradley is just uh, Orson from FE5 if he were an enemy. That's Fuck, it. You're right. That's it. You're right. And That's I entirely it. his character. God so, damn it, Ray! You ruined so, it for me. So the dude Good. is just vibe in a bad way. <laughs> Ray trying to bury this character. Oh, I'm super burying. I'm cutting a promo right now, burying this uh, dude live on stream. Oh shit, I started choking on my fucking monster. <laughs> when the battery yeah. overloads. I could rephrase that. That's how you guys so about the story about now how I basically have a battery holder now. No. Okay. Ron. Ron? Yeah. Remember the thing that M Gear gave me when you guys came to my house? Oh yeah. So instead of being a phone a phone holder, I just put a monster on it and I said it's my battery holder. <laughs> well, uh, you're making good use of it, I'll tell you that. <laughs> and that spells disaster Heaven for Bradley and sacrifice this Sunday in the casket match this Sunday at WrestleMania. <laughs> I like this. I like this angle. Oh, this. oh yeah, it's let's book it. Let's book this okay. angle, I like it. Look at all these OCs. They're coming out of the woodwork now. This is me this is yeah. me un untapped, full power. We were an honorable mercenary team. And then there's this asshole. And then there's the this asshole. For fame, for money. Oh yeah, it's Catherine. Someone call Merc. Hey Merc, look at the titties on screen.
It's the booba. The booba. Yes, the breasts, if you will. What if I don't I get the booba? What if you don't anyway? So, anyways, let's start a blasting. Power up! Wow! Sag. <laughs> How dare you! <laughs> Raymond! I don't know what I said. Right, please! I sort of normalized uh, promotion gains for all for most for, for most promotions of this. I like how you gave fucking everything anima, by the way. Yeah. Can you tell I like anima magic? Sage anima, bishop anima, druid anima. Do they get dark or light? Wait, the bishop gets anima? anima? Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, they did. I did see that earlier. You're right. It's free roll. We just don't get any bishops. Except for you get, Mia. You get, one, you get Mia. Yeah, DDs. She's coming. Aww. She's coming all along. Hey, are you gonna prove a Kyosuke? I am. <laughs> Wouldn't be rare if you didn't. Oh, it's okay, oh. I also like Anima. Look good. I quite like this palette, by the way. Anima is it's okay. still pretty good. <laughs> like, it's a pretty rough approximation of the All Titans color scheme. I like it. Now to quickly patch in the rev stake animation. <coughs> yeah, Rail, get right on that. No, he won't. He super fucking won't. <laughs> <laughs> I got a little 16. Ah, fuck it. I'll promote, I'll promote Cruise as well. I got time for Luna to catch up. It's okay, we're, we're getting Tempest back. Power up! Yeah, Tempest back. Don't worry, Ray's already made some room on the bench for him. I sure have. Sorry, Zach. That happens. So he gets to sip that nice bench juice. Zach harkens back to his fifty dollars and gets an idea. PayPal.com. How to rescind <laughs> money orders. No, I meant trying to convince them to use them for it. Holy shit. Holy oh. shit. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. Look, I got him to use Fang and Delatmol. I I'm 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 somewhere. <laughs> hey, Fang turned out. Like, she turned out pretty good, so no complaints there, I told Zach. You she's good. <laughs> no complaints there, Zach. Well, that was, that oh, was yeah, a, I love FF13 Fang. Yeah, she's alright, I guess. She's okay, I guess. I guess. She, she exists, I guess. It's just funny that I'm. It's uh, that I wasn't even the only one of the people that started playing Dilemma initially. Who Fang was just the hard carry on the team. As him. As him. Right. As him's problems weren't his fault, but his Fang was hard carry. God damn it, G. So, it looks like vanilla chapter 20, 21 at this point, with just the dudes coming in here. There's some little bit of exceptions. But then, there's Bleak, who's now in the corner, like he is in Hector, or like Eubens is in Hector mode. Yeah, his character sure is. He really is just a character in the corner. The name fits. He's here to throw snowballs and laugh at you. Nah, we're not at FTA. Sorry. But yeah, here's the, he also has the bearing of the first master weapon. Oh. Which are like the ones in pretty much exactly like the ones in uh Thracia, A rank brave weapons that hit hard, but are heavy as heck. You worry very big. Worry <laughs> very big, like Chef Can. Gee, can you tell? <laughs> Did it just double attack? <laughs> Well, if I wasn't that big of a fan, otherwise the Brave Bow would have the exact stats of a uh, FE5's Brave Bow, otherwise, e e aka broken as fuck. 
Oh boy, that's like my favorite rainbow ever because it's so fucking disgusting. It's so stupid! <laughs> oh, you added NPCs. Well, added is there is a strong. Those are actually the NPCs that are normally around the corners of the map, but they just oh, converged I... over to here, where Catherine is also holding up. And yeah, that's uh, where Heath is now. Hmm. He became Catherine. Catherine! So here's, if you so here's Plum. No, she's oh. not the Plum from Mario Golf. I don't know why people keep saying that! I mean, Man, I wonder why, hmm. Raymond, Mr. Looks, Mario Golf. Looks Profile at the picture. scrolling background. <laughs> looks at the scrolling background. Looks at your interest in Mario Golf. Looks at the character likeness. Hmm! <laughs> not, I mean that as name? I mean that as a joke. I know why. <laughs> I know why people keep saying that, but no, it's it's not. The, look, the circumstances for Plum's character being born is similar. She's she was Mario inspired, but not from the golfer. She's basically more uh, akin to Princess Peach, which is why her name's Plum, and her costume is purple. Princess Plum. Oh, easy. Sort of. They did the fusion dance, I guess. Uh, she's supposed to be uh, a Master Knight, or have have access to Master Knight, but Paladin was the closest bit, so... There you go. Uh, 75 HP, 45 strength, uh, 65 skill, 55 speed, 25 defense, 35 res, 55 luck. I can yeah. tell Ray likes heavy food. <laughs> Where the fuck is all one? This is the second character that we have heard the words was supposed to be a Master Knight. Master Knight is the fucking shit, bro. I Master expect Knight he will not be the last shit. character we will hear the words was supposed to be a Master Knight. <laughs> Alex would have been a Master Knight. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait for I can't ra wait for Ray to reveal that his grandmaster plan was to make his entire army Master Knights. Bro, Everybody actually? Everybody Master Knight with different ranks to, to, to <laughs> give them Bro, <laughs> actually, you know? Yeah. She just got HP. What the hell is... You have a whole army of Master Knights. The enemy just quits. <laughs> Finally, Sorry, Jay, he killed Glass. Gift. Mage Fighter died with him. <laughs> I once had a drawing idea in my head where all of my favorite characters, this was years ago, would I would try I would try to design them as Master Knights just for fun. Of course you would. Gosh darn it. See? Finally you, got it. You forced yeah. my hand. Now nah, I have to say it. Also, these Aussie Knights are slightly better than the ones you see in vanilla. They actually have a defense stat, but not much of one. They'll they'll still die all the same. You know, you gave them Junker to Nini, and think you might want to give it to Lenoan instead. No, her promo her promo gains will save her. Trust me. Okay. I believe it. I was about to make a comment. Like, oh, a mercenary. When did we recruit one of the. It's right. It's, it's me. The only one. It's the just The only right. mercenary. See, FE9. So, it's like, uh. It's like that one movie, The Last Samurai, except it's the last mercenary. Imagine Ray played by Tom Cruise. <laughs> Beer me. I don't know how I feel about that, Zach. <laughs> then who would you prefer to play your likeness? I don't know. In the FE404 movie adaptation. Danny Trejo. <laughs> Danny Trejo! <laughs> Ray's likeness. God damn it. I got it. Ray, that sounds like a fucking awesome movie, doesn't it? <laughs> 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 Yo, this archer though, going in. All right, all right, you ready, Ray? All right, I'm laying on. Get the Discord channel. Brace yourself. 
Uh-oh. I'm, 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 this is going to hit you hard. Kakagoika, Medisa. Cut the court. <laughs> yes! You know what? I'll take that. <laughs> Absolutely, I'll take that. I thought about that one picture I've seen of you where you have your head looking up and you got the shaved head, and I was like, all right, I know exactly Absolutely. what- Absolutely. Know exactly what celebrity to grab for this. You know what, Mel, you're right. <laughs> Oh, hey, Master Sword. Oh, hey, Master Knight. You know, in another universe, the personalities haven't changed. The people are exactly the same. But right, in another universe, you're Master Knight DH, and he's MK404. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no, no, it can't be. In this. Nothing else has changed except for names. No, it can't be. And also, the gravity is slightly higher. Are those mixtapes? He's still who he is. Unspeakable. You're still great, but the names have swapped because your love of Master Knights overcame the rest. Oh no. Oh no. I, I just unraveling. I dislike this post. He's frothing I at the mouth and rage. This. I did it. I solved the Da Vinci code. The Da Vinci. Da Vinci. Code. No, you just solved the Da Vinci code. Da Vinci. Da Vinci. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong, Merc? I'll div into where I please. Your text on a screen. You can't stop me. Merc recently just got playing thing through <laughs> Order of the Crimson Arm. How'd you like that, by the way? I'm still imagining, like, great quotes said by Danny Trejo, I'm not gonna lie. More like Order of the Crimson Arm. <laughs> I have no opinion. I'll live and die a filthy memer. Christian? Mm hmm How are you feeling? I've been fighting off a cold the past couple days. Oh. Are you winning? I mean, eventually. <laughs> yes. Are you winning right now? I mean... Are you winning, Watson? I don't sound awful now, do I? Well, you sound tired. Well, I mean, that's because I am. Oh, why are you so tired? Uh, because my MSQ scenario just popped and I'm going to Praetorium, I hope. I'm Damn so sorry. It. It's not Praetorium. Why would you want to go to Praetorium? Because that means more cutscenes, which means more experience, which means I can just look away from the screen and more on this screen instead. Well, there's more movement. All right, smart guy. There's more movement in the cast room. <coughs> cast room lasts like 20 minutes, though. Yeah, which means I get less experience. I, I'll be on my computer either way. I just need to move around more. Gabe told me he has feelings on unscapable cutscenes. They were not feelings. They were not feelings. And good, Merc. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Glad you had fun, Merc. Even if fun is, uh... Coincidental. Coincidental? Subjective? Words. Words! Hello, Kazanto, what's up? And, and also, because it's almost midnight, and today was oh, no. day, so... Ouch! You know. Wait, is she gonna be okay? I think she'll she be fine. She's hit. She got defense. It's fine. Oh, there's no, there's no other hits to survive. Okay, we're good. Okay, good. Phew! I have to add 
that, Dan. I don't know. I didn't make that thread. <laughs> this shit's whack, yo. A little bit. He hungers for battle. I wouldn't be surprised if that was dialogue. In this, I wouldn't put it past me, Chris. Mhm. Mm I would not put that pass past me. Tis another OC. So there's Catherine. You, she's here in case you're an editor and turn now or you didn't use her. Her girl star, 70 HP, 45 magic, 50 skill, 55 speed, 20 defense, 50 res, 45 luck. Since oh, the Raymond Chronicles, since we since we cussed her character, uh, Josh uh, moved. Josh and I moved her to. Uh, the FE404 re redone timeline era before uh, the Sacred Dawn stuff, and where she's like, she's still she's still around in that part that part of the party, and then she is a uh, mentor. To, she was supposed to be best friends with Jessica, who we see later in this ROM hack, but now they're a generation apart. So, oops. But she's still, but Jessica, and she still learns under under Catherine in this, in uh, that re revised timeline, she's just like 12 years old now before she becomes a uh, night captain in the revised timeline. You've gained knowledge. Of the last. Hey look, Tempest is dudes. The knowledge of the FP404 shall be great, whether you want it to be or not. Hey, I'm just providing. This is the Pogged Mercenary. The Brocenary. The bro scenario lives again. He's now like massively reborn. Their knowledge of the land. A mercenary reborn. We are a realm reborn. You're not the warrior. Oh, of Chris. Yes, I am. Thank you, Christian. You you went the direction I was. Oh, Christian. I'm always Poorly have done. Your direction wrong. Christian. Please, Daddy. <laughs> It's so nice to meet you. Dude. You must die. You must die. Yeah, that was it. Uh, Jessica's die. mom becomes the her the new bestie on uh, Catherine's regime and part of the part of the crew that's here. And Catherine still has beef, massive beef with Bleak. You fought Ozma in fourteen. Ah, uh, Vanessa, Vanessa, bless you. Bless no you. Spoilers. I know hey. I knew that. Yeah, but, but I didn't. Oh, didn't. Yeah. I am behind her in the FF14 experience. Well, at least you didn't say. Well, at least you didn't say where Oswald was. Good. Don't. Yeah. Or I'll clear the chat, and I won't Did be gentle. Clear Do not go gentle. Gentle persuasion. It will not be gentle. You will be persuaded against your will. Hmm. Damn, that's purple. Yes, a, her name is Plum. Do you get it? I, I know, but like, damn, it's purple. Yeah, so Ray literally looked at Princess Peach and was like, what if she was purple? Ah! ah! Just thinking about the conversation earlier. You know who would have been a master knight? Oh. Age. I'm gonna again. stop now. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. That was just so free. I had to take it. Uh. <laughs> it's fine. It was funny. Look. It was funnier than what I was gonna say. Let's fuck. Go ahead, Zach. Say, come on, get, get us. Come on, what do you got? What do you got? What do you got, bud? Megan. 
Me Megan? <laughs> Megan? 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 Gamer girl? Megan. It's not our time yet. Wait till the final chapter. Then it really will be her time. Of course. Look, if you have a gun and the shot is free, you take it. Who cares what the collateral? One of my favorite stupid lines That's their fault. is from fucking uh, Friday the 13th part, I think it's six, where a cop is being held up by the female lead and he just goes, Megan. Megan. Such an awful Yo, look at these NPCs actually funny helping funny each shit. other out. This is the dream. Full service, just like Susan. Oh no, there's an archer right there. Oh no. Pegasus, bro, escape. Escape. Oh no. It's more like Pegasus. Nope. nope. Pegasus. Nope. No. no! I avoided it! Frank! Ah! Uh, Amogus. Look, you started the train, but I'll drive it. No! You didn't have to leave the station! Don't worry, Zach. Pegasus girl is a safe. Yes. Oh. Yes. Wow, that's a fucking big sage. Jesus. They have good magic. And that's about it. Elowood is bigger. He's got this. You got this, Elowood. I believe. Ba -ba 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 Pure water. Speaking of that, how are your levels looking for your? your yeah, work? I was just about to check. Seventeen. Hello with pog as fuck. Twenty-eight. Where's long? She needs uh, twenty-two levels, so. Fourteen. Yeah, good. I forget. Is the requirement for for the other map fifty or forty? Fifty. Okay, ball up. You have to be uh, 50 or over to get the other map. Hot. I'll show you, Hot. Give me five minutes. Ugh. Give me five minutes. And? The one thing that I found very interesting after doing randomizers is that if you promote, like, your lords before uh, Four Fang Defense, uh, what, it, what ends up happening is that it doesn't calculate your promotion. It just calculates what your level is. Yeah, so that's how like, it would be, yeah. It should be. And it's, and it's like balling, and it's great. <laughs> oh, I was right. This is this is a good look. Oh, baby. Any good lane. Unless Wallace isn't great, and then it's not great anymore. Run. Yeah. Where's good lighting? Uh, in 14. Close to Del Sol? Yeah. Generally, old eye areas because they're usually pretty bright. Close to Del Sol. Good shot. Good choice. Oh, actually, I forget, right? Do the Valkyries have light magic too? <clears throat> no, just Anima. Also, just Anima because they're mounted. You can also ask Dan when he's on later. He's pretty sure they're just Anima. He's, he's all about the yeah. G pose. Gotcha. Oh! <laughs> don't, don't even bother with range, just pop him. Zangando. Zangando! Oh. Well, it would be, Ron, but there's a problem. What? <laughs> ah. Just go to your house. <laughs> Job cruise. Yeah, I guess. I guess. guess well, there's, I the there, 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 there's some bright areas in Stormblood, but you have to be in Stormblood. Ah! Time for Catherine's team to give you like a guiding ring because they all survive. Oh, you wish Ray could do that. I wish Ray could do that. Miss Catherine. See, I told you, you wish Ray could do that. <laughs> I you do. You absolutely wish, yeah. Probably would have been I a thing. I, I would have been a thing where I could have done if I could. <clears throat> oh, it's raining everywhere in Old Army. Fuck. Stop 
raining. Damn. Today is not photo day, apparently. Ah. Yeah, I'm good, Agramar. Pretty good today. That's not an answer. Are you feeling like, uh, <laughs> Are you feeling something healthy? Whichever. Maybe I'll get it. Maybe I'll get an apple. Just to clear my throat. An apple? And make my voice sound good. Where are, where are those guys going? You got a lot of you got a lot of voices to do, don't you? Uh, no, not really. Oh, is Christian gonna be back to blue? Huh? What? Ah, oh, that guy. Oh, uh, I mean, yes. Yeah, he's gonna be there. I also gave him maggot because uh, I was voicing a lot of characters. Maggot. Yeah. Tito. Matita. Matita. Uh, what about? Well, I mean, I guess Tito won't be show up much. <laughs> Yeah. Oh yeah, uh, I guess I could say this in stream as a little surprise. Uh, I was gonna surprise everyone, but uh, for those Fuck of you, it. for those of you who are here, you get a sneak peek. I'm gonna do something special before the start of the trail session. Oh! Wow. Oh. <laughs> Zach. What? Uh, that, that was a bit more. Uh, what are you hyped for? You got me excited. Uh, Okay. I won't be there, but you got me excited. Well, uh, it's before and after. Uh, the before thing is, uh, I'm gonna rate all the S-Crafts. All right, Maximilian. Yeah, that's pretty much inspired by that. Because, <laughs> uh, there's some really cool S-Crafts in the game. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> we're gonna, and Christian, we're gonna see the opening of, uh, Girls in the Sky 3. Yeah. I, I was gonna say... Um, like, I mean, at the end, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Once you've beaten the game. I, I was gonna say, hey, since you're not gonna play this one for a while, a couple months, years, might as well hold up. Uh, might as well watch the intro. Yeah, yeah. Damn, Mel, that's hot. Yeah, my turn. The purple was good. <laughs> Thank you, dyes. Dyes are good in this game. That is the custodian armor for Gunbreaker. Very, very pod. The gun blade having a wooden handle is very funny to me. <laughs> Shire gear is really nice. Don't steal my look. I'm not stealing. This isn't even the same color as you. <laughs> Don't you have a new dress? No, I pissed it over. Just that was just for the, the wedding. Ah. Uh, we're looking on you. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Ron's like, put, put, it, put it back. <laughs> Brother. Well, Merc, once you get yourself a new computer, you too can play the critically acclaimed Final Fantasy XIV. It allows you to play up to heaven sword at good in level 60 the first expansion of the free trial app. Thank you. All raw. Including our raw, which are now available for the free trial. Every, every time you say that, it makes me think, makes me think of the 
the fucking ride in the car with Ron. Hope you don't mind listening to music from the critically acclaimed Final Fantasy IV. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I, I told Bean that, and the first thing he tried to do was jump out the window. <laughs> uh, uh, it, it was it was really good, Rock. Yeah. I'm glad that you made it. Uh, I enjoyed myself. I don't know how the fuck I was getting M gear and Bean from that Jack in the Box to my house. Uh, if where there's a will, there's a bus. Yeah. Where there's a will, there's a bus. Damn. It was still really funny that they got Jack in the Box and right next to it was this super great meat market. And I was like, hey, Ron, you want to go get tacos? And he was like, sure. That was a good taco. Ray, I can't believe she killed him. That's murder or something. A little bit. Anyway. She was on the other <laughs> foot, anyway. Big. Let he who has never killed before be Yeah, we literally to told we, we had M Gear and Beam wait by the uh, car while yeah, me and Ron went into the meat market and got tacos. That was good. Let he can't believe you left your kids in the car. Oh no, we did. Yeah, I can. <laughs> I was like, uh, you guys are not getting in this car because you might die. What? It was hot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Even Smoking. though being in M gear, we're sitting there in fucking jackets. Smoking sexy style. Oh, you know, we Californians are like that. We just sit in jackets, even Hate in the it. hot weather. Just like Canadians sitting in shorts in the middle of the winter. Hmm. Ten feet apart. No, we're all gay. Yeah, it's a nice outfit. I like the silver. I I like I like the purple because it didn't cover all the black, so you just get a lot of different tones. It's good. Yeah. So you drop you're dropping good color scheme. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Class fucking sucks. Not sorry, Ace. <laughs> wow. It's, uh, I, I don't really play bar, but I've heard it's been very notorious for being boring. Yeah, that is a good color scheme, Mel. Yes. It pops that actually in a good way. Because Bard is my favorite class in most things. Your glorified archer, it sucks. Yeah. I would have oh. preferred it was a hunter from uh, Final Fantasy Tactics. A hunter must hunt. If they oh, give I you more musical based ability. Well, yeah. If they went full Bard or full archer, but they decided to do both, and, and then it was boring. Yeah. So, what are you going to look into next? Or are you just going to stick Gunbreaker? Ninja! Ninja. Yeah, interesting. <laughs> go and hit you, go and hit you, go! Mm. Well, Hoy, get out of here, kid! Mm. Time to go from the most boring, easiest class to the one of the most complex ones. Didn't tell me what Ninja does. Didn't sound very complex. Ninja! She no me no cry! Mel aiming to match up to F. Mel aiming to match up F those ninja skills. <laughs> Weeb? Y yes. Absolutely. Uh, tell me how the ninja story actually goes, because I've never actually seen it. Oh, well, rogue story is where you gotta start. 